Hello and welcome to the AI Innovation Tools. Today we have Harpa AI, which is an assistant for chat GPT and also a web automation tool. With Harpa AI, you can integrate chat GPT to your Google search and also automate web monitoring tasks. In this video, I'm going to show you what are the use cases of Harpa AI and how you can use it. So without wasting any time, let's start the video. The installation of Harpa AI is very straightforward. You just need to go on harpa.ai and just simply click on this free plugin button and it will take you to the Chrome extension page where you just need to click on add to Chrome button and it will be downloaded and installed on your browser. Once you're done downloading and installing the Chrome extension, you just need to go on Google and you will see this dialog here if you click on it it will ask you to log in your chat gpd account you just need to click on login button and log in your chat gpt account okay so when you are done logging into your chat gpt account this is how it will look like here you can interact uh, with the chat gpt as same as you interact on their platform like uh, you can type the question what is chat uh, gpt and it will answer you as same as it answer on their platform it's uh, almost the same here's the advantage of harpa ai uh, they have 100 plus predefined uh, commands which you can use like uh, abstract research and SEO keywords. They have marketing and SEO category. They have control category, productivity, uh, copywriting and uh, engineering. So they have so many commands which you can use. Like uh, I'll show you some. Like uh, if you want to generate Instagram hashtag, you just need to uh, click on the prompt and what is your Instagram post is about. Just Tell it what is your Instagram is post is about. So let's say uh, home decor, and it will automatically generate us some hashtag related to home decor. See, so this is how it works. They have so many uh, prompts available, and you can just click on this uh, button here, or simply type slash here. It will show all the commands. I'll tell you what happened in the background. Basically, as you can see, there's no conversation here, no new chat here. But if you reload the page, you will see a conversation here by Harpa. Right? So, and this is the prompt it has generated for us. And this is the category that we have provided. And this is the output. As same as we have... Uh, got here and uh, so this is how you use it and there's so many more you can uh, summarize and content on a page let's say uh, let's say we go out chat uh, gpt wikipedia page <laughs> okay and then we need to uh, summarize the article what we can do is just simply click on it the icon and uh, type uh, summary and they just click on it and they just enter so these variable these two variable let me tell you what are these this is the language that we have selected in the setting and this is the context of the page itself so if you want to use it or uh, your custom context you can give it here or if you want to use the web page content you just give it like this only and if you want to uh, select a section of a page you just need to click here click on this arrow button and just uh, select any paragraph or content you want to extract from this page and just simply click on it it will extract all the content that you have selected and uh, in the context variable it will use only that paragraph
when you hit enter it will automatically generate a prompt for you i'll show you in the uh, chat gpt and this is the summary it has generated for us now if you go back in the chat gpt you will see the conversation here and in the conversation we have the prompt this is the prompt and this is the content we have selected from that page Okay, so this is it. Uh, this is how you use Harpa. But uh, if you want more tapped video uh, on this uh, tool, let me know in the comment section. I'll create a tapped video for this tool. Hope you like the video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more AI innovating tools.